Hey guys, busy and buzzy morning here. We are out the door to homeschool group and I wanna show you this no-brainer dinner. All I'm doing is dumping four pounds of chicken breast into the slow cooker and piling on a, a bottle of barbecue sauce. You can do homemade barbecue sauce. You can Google healthy recipes for barbecue sauce. I'm just using plain old barbecue sauce on this and we will have pulled chicken barbecue on hamburger buns tonight for dinner, probably a side of green beans. So I'll show you how I do this. So here, here is the chicken going into the slow cooker. I put this on defrost for a few minutes in my microwave. And excuse the barbecue sauce bottle noises, but I am dumping in this barbecue sauce. And it is going to cook all day while we are gone. And when we come home, voila, it'll be done. I also put just a little bit of water in my barbecue sauce and I'm shaking it up and I'm gonna pour this into the chicken too. There we go. And the lid is on and that is that. I'm also gonna do a quick what's in our lunch bag for homeschool group. The kids are outside having a quick run before we go and I'm just gonna show you what we're packing. Now our homeschool group, we used to do like a big pot luck whenever we got together and I always liked that but I know with all the, the allergies and different dietary needs that becomes cumbersome for a large group. So now whenever we have our meetings, everyone packs their own lunch and then when we do our end of year and beginning of the year picnics, everybody brings something and has ingredient labels and everything and we have picnics together that way. So here's the bag that I pack and I'm just gonna unload it for you and show you what's in it. This is a pack of cookies actually. One pack of cookies from the other day that's left and then I have a pack of napkins. I have a thing of bananas. I have about half a box of raisins. A pack of banana chips. I have some spoons, because you'll see I have some yogurt in here. Then I have, from the freezer, we have about 12 peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Super easy, didn't have to make those. Then I have 12 yogurts, and I've just put an ice pack on top of them, because we're gonna have lunch not too long after we get there. Also, for the younger kids, I have these little, like, little tray plates. The older kids and I, we can just handle not having a plate and having a sandwich in our hand and getting what we need. So that's my real quick what's in our homeschool group lunch bag for today. Super simple. So we're leaving the house pretty clean. We got the dishwasher going. I'm going to have one of my big boys come in and get the big bag of food from our lunch. And today also my husband got me a new coffee mug. Yay, Travis. Okay guys, we are back from our very full homeschool time with our group and now just checking in on this chicken and look, dinner's done. There it is. All I need to do now is I'm gonna break the chicken up with my spatula and it'll be pulled chicken barbecue. So I've just been here shredding it gently with my spatula. There's no other vegetables or anything in here, so the chicken is cooperating. It's very tender. Well, friends, we've already been chowing down on this barbecue, just having a very informal dinner tonight. The kids are sitting around watching a bear documentary, and I'm just refilling them with little sandwiches as they need them, and I'll just show you what this looks like. So we have our pulled chicken barbecue. I just take a little scoop of it down on the bun. If you're real Southern, you can add coleslaw to it or hot sauce or however it works for you. And there we go, a little pulled chicken barbecue sandwich. It did not take a lot of thought or a lot of effort. So I will see you next time with another brand new video. Bye-bye.